Castle had a fight, Barnard Castle is Nick Timothy. Watcher. Just when we were despairing of the days of political debate are dead, we had the intellectual heavyweight match between him and him. Highlights were President Trump saying to Joe Biden, there's nothing smart about you, and Joe Biden coming back with, will you shut up, man? Now, I don't know about you, but I was transported back to ancient Athens. Over here, our own prime minister seemed confused about how many people he's allowed to see out of doors. It may be the grouse shooting exemption that confused him, but can you blame him? I mean, the differences in who we can see and where and when are stark between Newcastle, Cardiff and London, for example. Except, didn't he write some or at least most of these rules? You'd need a PhD to understand them all, but you can't get one of those because all students seem to be in lockdown. Oh, well, Anushka. There certainly has been a lot of confusion this week, as you said. The rule of six turns out to be not that simple. So kids count in England, but not in Scotland or Wales, where there are stricter limits on households, but different rules outdoors. And as for that pub curfew, it's 10 for most of us, but 11 in Northern Ireland, which I have to say I thought was throwing out time anyway. The tweet thread that I most enjoyed on this came from the barrister, Adam Wagner, who <laughs> tried to clear up, I'm not even joking, the differential rules around karaoke before confusing himself and realising that it's only in the northeast that landlords must not allow singing in groups of two or more indoors. But... Are we overdoing this? How confused is the public, really? We have some exclusive polling from JL Partners looking at a variety of current or potential measures. And when asked about clarity, that's how clear things are, the results are actually not that bad for the government in most areas. The vast majority think the isolation rules with symptoms and the 10pm curfew is really quite simple not meeting other households, a little bit less so. It does drop for the rule of six to 69%. So nearly a third of people feel a bit confused about that. And in fact, Robert was talking about the regional differences. That number is lowest in the northeast. It drops to 60%. So that's clarity. But do people think that these measures are effective? If I bring that up, you'll see that it actually drops quite a lot. Only around half of people think that the app and the rule of six will be effective. But when it comes to the 10 p.m. curfew, it drops to just 31 percent. Now, despite all of this, one thing is clear. On a day that Patrick Valance has suggested we're losing control of this pandemic again, most people think that none of these measures go far enough. Robert. Thank, thanks so much, Anushka. So much to talk about. Um, Nick, I'm going to